right here, just now, exactly in this place. So often, we consciously choose the right place at the right time. Why not regarding our visions and plans as well? What if your desired location for your construction project does not remain just a wish? With our new innovative system, we realize your idea from the ideal point of view for your project. Building efficiently, sustainably, and future-oriented. Because the right place counts for a sustainable future. Bauer Machine. Situations and challenges the modern construction industry faces in the daily tasks that are performed. Did you often think about the fact, uh, what would it be like if you could build exactly where the building needs to be, even in an urban environment? That's a task that we have tackled as a manufacturer of uh, foundation equipment. And with uh, today's Bauer Studio, we're going to present to you the world novelty of the Bauer Cube system. With me today is uh, Rüdiger Kaup, the CEO of the Bauer Maschinen GmbH, Franz Werner Garrison, the head of our method development department, and myself, Christian Gress. Welcome to the Bauer Studio. Rudy, you have been instrumental in developing this new technology. Would you let us know what this is all about? Yeah, thanks. Thanks, Christian. Um, it's, it's really a revolutionary technology. It's a, it's a complete new thinking out of the box. We were really thinking about creating, uh, um, creating a system which actually uh, follows our mega trends. And uh, uh, when you talk about uh, urbanization in, uh, in the mega cities all around the world, uh, uh, the, the need for new infrastructure is actually really exploding in all, all the, uh, these big cities already, but more, more even in the future. And, uh, uh, and so there is a need to build, um, especially when it comes to infrastructure, to build where the people actually need to, to get uh, uh, into the new subway station or into, uh, uh, into new methods to uh, travel from A to B. And, uh, uh, and these, uh, um, these new infrastructure problems, they actually really cry out for new, for new ways how to, how to build uh, um, in a way which is more sustainable. And, uh, uh, and I know sustainability is a buzzword. Everyone talks about it, but we really take it uh, serious. We actually, we actually came up with uh, our Bauer Cube system, which we actually like to introduce today in far more detail. We came up with, uh, with that system because uh, it's not just um, being able to build where you normally wouldn't be able to, uh, uh, to build an underground uh, subway station, for example, um, but it's also to avoid noise or to avoid dust. Everyone in a city is complaining about construction zones. So uh, uh, with that new technology, which we will see in far more detail in the coming minutes, this is, um, these are the the challenges we had in mind when we, mm -hmm. when we really uh, uh, stepped out of the box and developed that, that new technology. I think there is a little video clip that, uh, you, had to, ah. uh, that you had prepared for us, right? Yes, yes. Yeah. So uh, might as well take a look at it, huh? Exactly. Thank you very much. Yeah. We are getting bigger. We are getting faster. We want to go further. Our world is modern and digital. Our future is sustainable. However, does growing mean more noise? Does progress mean that the old has to give way to the new? We at Bauer Maschinen develop innovative solutions for urban planning in order to intervene as little as possible in the existing infrastructure. 
with our world first Bauer Cube system, a cooperation between construction specialist Denise and equipment specialist Bauer Machinen, we are able to build exactly where it makes sense, appropriately and precisely. The Bauer Cube system enables the construction of underground railway stations or logistic centers beneath existing buildings, as well as the underground rehabilitation of dams. With our many years of experience and expertise, we break new ground and contribute to a better quality of life in cities. Make history with your next building project with our new Bauer Cube system. Bauer, passion for progress. Yeah, and as you just could see, with, uh, with our many years of experience in special foundation, and especially in uh, cutting, cutting technology, in cutting technology systems, we, uh, um, we, really, we really fought out of the box. And, uh, um, and this is where, where, where we think it's, uh, uh, it's very necessary to move our society into, into that direction. Thank you very much, Rudy. That was, uh, that was very helpful to understand what this is about. Uh, Franz Werner, with your experience, with your many years, with your decades in the foundation industry, you had a lot of input in the development. Uh, give us your insight from the construction perspective on the new system. Yeah, Christian, thanks for the introduction. First of all, I think um, to look at the design of this new Bauer Cube system, it must be said that it's, let's say, based on our proven mm -hmm. cutter technology. And, uh, but it's just fitted into a container-sized model as an innovative compact design. Mm -hmm. And this uh, innovative design offers opportunities not imaginable before. So and uh, when we look into the more detailed situation of this container-sized cube system, container is somehow a keyword showing what's going on there with this mm -hmm. design. And, uh, this really describes the design. And instead of having a crane mounted setup for a cutter, now all relevant cutter components are somehow fitted into a container sized model, just lined up for procedures. Mm -hmm. And uh, using this layout, the complete setup fits into a high cube container, which we saw in the video of a maximum height of 2.9 meter which offers the opportunity to work under limited height never seen before or working in small tunnels, for example. As a specific detail, I think we must say that the cutter frame is split in two pieces only. And due to the dimension of this uh, cutter frame, it's split into two pieces and these two pieces are mounted and connected above the trench prior to the start of the cutting process. And of course, even these two pieces are fit together, they are only 3.6 meter in height. And to ensure the requirements in terms of verticality, obviously, this frame is equipped with steering devices. So uh, yeah, now we know how this uh, system is constructed. Uh, Rudy, anything to add from your side? Yeah, this is what uh, um, Hans Werner just said. It's, it's really it's really the, uh, um, um, the technology allows to work in very confined spaces and, and to work even in an underground uh, parking lot or even in micro tunnels, mm -hmm. as, uh, as, as you already pointed out. And, uh, um, and there, in these confined spaces, uh, uh, you also have to, to look for safety. And, uh, um, and this is one, one major, mm -hmm. one major uh, um, yeah, task for us as uh, uh, construction uh, machinery uh, uh, manufacturer, we always have to watch out how safe the system is actually uh, um, uh, in, in, in its operation. And, uh, uh, and we actually have a, a, a number of even patents now, which, uh, uh, which we actually put in place, which actually allows that machine, if people have to be underground with the system, they are um, uh, completely safe in their working environment, or in the next step, we even think about to have it completely in autonomy, which actually allows that system to remotely work underground without even having people there. 
So uh, uh, this is a very, very big further step into uh, um, coming up with, with new technology. I mean, Rudy, this is absolutely correct, and uh, that's, that's the one thing. One is the dimensions, and one that it is away from the surroundings. But I'm thinking of a few more, and maybe, maybe these are the obvious advantages, of course. But Franz Werner, there is, you know, apart from these specific advantages, the size and, and the position of the equipment, I'm thinking about things like, uh, you know, uh, 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 noise, uh, impact on the environment compared to, uh, to existing slurry wall technology. Is there anything that you would like to add from that perspective? Yeah, of course, first of all, due to the fact that it's a small size, we have already, let's say, limited <laughs> transports, so uh, reduced uh, traffic. And uh, for sure that we are mainly working in underground construction, um, we have less noise at the surface. We need less space for the setup of the whole job site, so there is not so much impact in the surrounding neighborhood mm. as usually required. So these are just some of the examples. So, well, I summarize is good for the environment and uh, yeah, thanks for the explanation. It's, it's good for the personnel working there and of course for the residents and for, for communities uh, as a whole. Um, so uh, how would we, what, what are the typical applications? Where would, you, where would we use that new technology, maybe Rudy. Yeah, if I, may, Rudy. if I may come in. Um, this, is, this is one thing. Uh, um, first, when we actually started to develop this, this system, to have, uh, when we had the first idea, we actually did that in cooperation with, uh, with our cooperation partner, Denis. And uh, they came up with, um, with, uh, with, with an idea, and we, we, we developed it to, together with them. And we all thought about uh, underground subway stations and uh, and to build them where it really needs to be however when you when you think further when you really when you really get the whole the whole possibilities which you can actually now uh, um, uh, get to in order with uh, um, when you take that system into operation you could actually imagine it's for underground water storage it is for um, computer server systems. Everyone talks about cloud systems. And cloud systems, they actually have server, server needs which have to be climatized. And, uh, uh, and to put them underground in a city where they actually are supposed to be. And uh, uh, so any, any cavity, any, uh, any room underground which can be used for storage, which also can be used for energy storage, like battery storage. Mm -hmm. So there are, there are numerous of applications which uh, uh, come to, uh, to, 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 to your mind when you really think through it. It's, it's amazing. Mm, thank you very much, Rudy. Uh, when it comes to application, your expertise comes into play. Let us know what, uh, what you did uh, when it came to developing yeah. these applications. Applications, we heard already a lot. There are much more ideas already existing for using this system. But of course, we need to understand how we can use this system under these restricted conditions. Because there are topics like concreting, reinforcing, and so mm -hmm. on and so on. And also to get an insight in this, uh, we also created animations. We did some virtual reality. Uh, and maybe we have a chance to ah, look to this idea. virtual reality. Mm -hmm. Rudy, please yeah, show yeah, us what we have. Yeah, that's a great idea. I, I nearly forgot about it. Um, yeah, we actually have a, a virtual reality uh, application and uh, uh, very easy, but it's, it's very important uh, because uh, a lot of uh, um, city planners, for example, they, 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 they need to understand the idea and therefore we created that virtual reality. And let me start that. I, I, I get that started right away. And uh, um, you should see it now in any second here on your on your screen. Yeah, Rudy, Franz Werner, 
dear audience, I'm convinced this will make a difference. And we look forward to presenting that new method, that new construction equipment to you in person. We have our this year's in-house exhibition, the Bau Erleben Days, coming up. We will start that from uh, June 14 onward for the next few months. And you're more than happy uh, to come and visit us here in uh, Schrobenhausen. You can see the equipment live and in operation. And please contact us as you can uh, see in the contact details to follow. And again, thank you very much, Rudy, Franz Werner. Thanks. A few more pictures and we say goodbye to you and see you next time in the Bauer Studio. Thank you. Noise is everywhere in nature. In our everyday lives. On construction sites. But there is a point when it becomes too much. When a noise becomes noise. When it annoys and stresses you. Noisy construction sites? No thanks. No more preventable noise. We create innovations with our systematic low noise approach. Bauer Cube System.